Beautiful. That's excellent. Praise him. You know, he looks amazing. You know, you hit that free stack. Then all you got to do is put your hand in position for the head straight mm -hmm. and then come in from the top to hold that head. And he turns into a statue. And I mean, it, look at I have goosebumps right now. It's just amazing. So you should have that confidence right here because he's going to look better than every other dog that's inside that ring yeah. without a doubt. Anything. And you don't have to do Make anything. Good. Yeah. yeah like, <laughs> he does it all on his own. Yeah. Okay, so give me another down and back. And the first one is going to be to a non baiting judge. Wow. I like that. Praise him, reward him. Yes. <laughs> that was good. Yay. Okay, I would try the next one without having any bait in your hand because I want him to focus on your hand, yeah. but not try to eat out of your hand as you're running. Okay, so you're going to go ahead and hand me a piece of bait. Okay, you're going to take him down and back again, and I want you to really focus on timing because I want him out there. So as he's coming to the judge, I don't want him pulling into that lead. Yeah. So I want you to give like some little t vibrations to let him know to slow down, but not so much that you're pulling on it so he turns around and looks at you. Okay. Okay, so down and back. Let's go. Uh -huh. Moby. Wow. And you went loose. That's beautiful. Yes. That was awesome. Good job. Wasn't that beautiful? Yeah, that, beautiful that was fantastic. Yeah. That was really good. Okay, give me a go around all the way to the end and give me some solid five positions over there when I ask for them. Okay. Real good go around. Watch your eye contact. See, the eye contact is forcing him to go somewhere else. You want that hand established and no eye contact. Good. Let's go. Good. Good. Much better. Oh, God, that's so good. Beautiful. You went down from the bottom first, which I'm very happy to see you do that. Beautiful. Okay, now come in with your left hand. Yep, that's excellent. All right, praise him. That's beautiful. Nice smile, too. Okay, give me position two. Ready? Good. Very nice. Good. Okay, get some more distance. Praise and reward. Release. Good. Beautiful. Very good. Okay, give me a position three. Now this time when you do position three, I want you to throw the bait directly in line in front of him. You threw it over to the side last time. Okay. So he was stacked and his head was turned and it didn't look as good. Okay. So I'm going to throw it. Okay. Just like that. Release. Okay, get it. That was much better because that way he's looking straight ahead, up over his, his front like this. Mm -hmm. Excellent, excellent stack. But when you throw it crooked, he's like this. Uh -huh. And so it just, just took a little bit of that away. Okay, give me a position four. Wow. Okay. <laughs> he already knew. Praise and release. <laughs> Good. Not look at me. Well, don't look at him. Yeah. So I was trying to stare at the hand, and then he's like, "Okay, hand." Yeah, yeah. Right. So you broke on that. So maybe when you're doing that, you can have one of your hands like like the stop sign. Okay. And that way he won't break when you if you move or something like that. Okay. And start really working on a release word. So he's breaking off of that release word and not body or something. Okay. All right. So release him. Release. Okay. Give me a position five. <laughs> That's cute. 
cute. You are cute. Okay, softer side. Release him. Release. Good. Good. Work on that that final fi fifth position. Try to try to figure out some way to do something fun when you do that. Okay. okay. So here we're going to work on you manipulating his position in a stack. Okay, so I want him free stacked on with his front on the long pad. And I want you to see if you can get him to the point where you use your body and your feet. Like for instance, if you want him to go to that pad, maybe turn a foot, turn your body, and move over here to get him to put a stack here. Then when you want him to go over there, you move your foot, your body, and go like this to see if you can get him to stack on this one. Okay, okay so go for it. Go ahead. There, good. Yes, good. Very nice. Okay, now get him to switch back onto the other one. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? <laughs> good. Praise the heck out of him. Okay. Did you reward him? No. Payment. Payment. Yes. The quicker the reward, the quicker they're going to learn. Okay, get him on the other one. Yes. Yeah, that was awesome. Okay, so I want you to work on this one more between now and the next show. Yeah. Because he, you know, he does good going from one direction to the other. Maybe he's, you know, right pod. <laughs> yeah. But I want to get it to the point where you get really subtle, like, you know, you can stand in front and just like move a foot and, and go like this and he'll hop on to the next one. Yeah. And then so you got him here and you want him to shift over there. So you take your foot, move it over, shift over like this and he'll hop on to that one. Okay. When you can get to that point there, you're establishing some amazing communication. Okay. okay. All right. So we'll call this one. Good.